Now, in Unit 1, I introduce you to the context and relevance of the chapter. Unit 1 is divided into three sections. Now, let's get started with Section 1, Context of Chapter 8. In this chapter, we address the interpretation of a topic, or more specifically, the selection of a name. Section 2. Relevance of Chapter 8 In previous chapters, a basic understanding of academic research in theory and practice, as well as the foundations, the terminology and the research process itself has been developed. Furthermore, the elements of a research paper have been introduced and discussed. The next step is to come up with an interpretation of a topic in a given research situation and thereby the identification of a suitable research question. Accordingly, the context of this chapter is to come up with an interpretation of a topic as a prerequisite for the structuring of your research project. Why is it relevant to start with an interpretation of a topic before you structure your research project? First of all, interpretation ensures precision while analyzing a potential aim of a research project. Thereby, a false approach of the research project can be avoided. Section 3. Learning Objectives of Chapter 8 What are the learning objectives of this chapter? After this chapter, you should understand a widely used interpretation technique and its three process steps. Furthermore, you should be able to differentiate the five potential aims of research projects. Additionally, you should comprehend different problem setups in the context of real-life research situations. Finally, you should be able to analyze a name in the context of a problem setting.